in the year of our Lord 2021 without wasting much time we are going direct to the head of the Directorate of States Ma Zicheka Edosiem to give us the briefing Ma Ze, you are welcome over to you Thank you so much, Master Jonathan, and good evening from here. Good evening, good afternoon, good morning, and good night to all of you, great bear friends all over the world, depending on your time zone. My name is Ma Zichika Edoziem. I come from Ihe Oma. Oma is in Olu province of Biafra land. And by the grace of Elohim, the mighty and merciful Chukoka Biyama, I serve the indigenous people of Biafra in the Directorate of State as the head of Directorate. Biafrans, I'm, I bring you message of goodwill from the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra Nye Dumas in Namde Kano. Despite or irrespective of his condition, irrespective of the tortures that he has been put through and continue to be put through. Our leader's main thought is about the family of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB worldwide. He has all of you in his prayers that you all may remain resolute, that you all may remain focused disciplined and unwavering in our march to freedom and in our struggle to restore and reclaim not only our heritage but the honor of our people. I will therefore ask all of you to as well as Oyendu has you in his prayers we as well must have him in our daily prayers. I am quite aware, very much aware of the expectations of our people as it concerns our struggle for freedom. I am also aware of their expectations on the leadership of the indigenous people of Biafra worldwide. I wish to state that the Directorate of State of the Indigenous People of Biafra is working assiduously and in consonance in tune, in agreement with IPOB's fundamental principles policies and objectives. This Directorate of State, which our leader Mazen and the Colonel put together, we shall not deviate one bit from any of these fundamental principles and policies and objectives because, because they are the soul of our movement end of our struggle. It is therefore in this regard that I will be holding a meeting with IPOB USA principal servants on the 25th of July 2021. I repeat, I will be holding a very important meeting with 
myself, and of course, some members of the directorate with the IPOB USA principal servants. And those who will be invited to that meeting will, of course, be properly informed. The Continental Rep for North America will be instructed on the details for this very meeting. And while I am on USA, it is very, very saddening that we seem to ignore the precarious situation which this family is presently in. It, is, it seems that we probably did not quite comprehend that this moment is a moment in which we must put all our energy together and use that energy to pursue is being made and must continue to be made because the single most important thing that we have to do that this great family need to do is to ensure that we focus on making sure that the health the health of the leader of this great movement Oyen Madinan Bikano is not in any way jeopardized while he remains in the custody of the Zoological Republic of Nigeria. And we cannot, by our own selves, we must not, by our own selves, contribute to a situation that will, in, even if in a very little way, complicate his very serious health situation. This very movement must all join hands together to ensure that our leader is a free man at the shortest possible time from this day forward. Our lawyers are doing excellent well and our diplomatic engagement is also running smoothly our civil disobedience is being heard all over the world therefore every person who sees himself in a position of service to the Biafran people you must disregard anything what that whatever that may be that will dissipate our energies and strength from focusing on what is very very essential today for us as IPOB family members our leader is in the hands of the enemy many of you or some of you 
who have been coming online and writing things or you know even um having their programs uh, live programs you may have some genuine complaint you may have a very cogent reason why you feel that something has gone wrong somewhere yes you may have it but i want to tell you that this very moment is not the appropriate time to deal on some of these matters because the directorate will not for any reason abandon our work to get our leader out of the hands of the wicked out of the hands of the enemy we cannot abandon abandon our responsibility to ensure that his health is not in any manner jeopardized while dealing with some of these issues that are being raised on social media or that are being sent around to family members i therefore appeal to those of you in usa please do not aggravate the situation of our leader while he remains in the hands of the enemy i will make this appeal this last one and i believe we all understand what is confronting us and we all must put our hands together to ensure that oyendo is with us the soonest the indigenous people of biafra we are a race under severe threat of extinction we all know this many of us have witnessed it many have experienced it personally the nigerian government is very actively actively eliminating the afran youth faster than any disease or natural cause can and when we see these things we still do not understand that we must pull in one direction we must unify our front we must not allow the enemy to come into us or in our midst and cause havoc because from north to south east to west our youths are being massacred they are being not just tortured they are being given the most inhuman treatment one can imagine of course when our leader is out we will hear the true fact and the true events from him be aware that most of these clandestine and covert killings they happen and many of them majority of them are not heard about when our killers get emboldened by the actions or lack of it that is coming from those who self acclaimed themselves to be political leaders from Biafra land elders religious leaders when our killers observe that these people they cannot do anything they cannot say anything these killers lose every sense of pretense and commit these murders then in the open 
Ladipo market is not an isolation. Ladipo market where I'm not quite sure how many, but a number of Biafrans were killed. For what reason? It happened in Enugu just this past month. Cold-blooded murder of Biafran people. And you have leaders. You have leaders. They have gone quiet. They can see nothing. They can say nothing. The only person, the only person who spoke, continued to speak, and will continue to speak and defend the rights of Biafran people is at this moment in the hands of the enemy. And some of us, some of us are dissipating their strength and their energy in writing and diverting our attention. Please advise yourself very properly. Advise yourself very properly. So that we can focus on what needs to be done. Your leaders, so-called, they have become blind, deaf and dumb, all at the same time, because they have conveniently decided to see nothing. They have decided to hear nothing, they have decided to say nothing while they are supposed people, the constituencies, from where they took off to become political leaders, or the constituencies where they rule or lead as traditional rulers, or PGs, are going through unimaginable and barbaric inhuman torture. They cannot help any of you. They have no desire. They have no intention. They do not have the balls to help us, the Afghan people. Therefore, the only person who can help us is our leader, and we must do everything within human and spiritual power to ensure that he rejoins this family sooner than later. Now, to the ongoing efforts by the zoo government to compromise, this is what they know. Corruption is the second name of the Zoological Republic of Nigeria. They are going about compromising people in Biafra land. They are going about calling our elders to nocturnal meetings. They are going about inviting our market leaders to clandestine meetings to bribe them, to throw some, some, some change to them. And you, you have to ask yourself where the change is coming from, where these monies are coming from. These are funds, money that was taken from your land and you are being compromised by just giving you a little bit of what belongs to you. Those of you that has been approached by the agents of the Nigerian government, you know yourselves. You know yourself. You are therefore advised to retrace your steps because the spirit of our departed heroes and the land of Biafra shall visit you. It's, it's, it's a promise I'm making. And I'm saying it here live on Radio Biafra worldwide that if the politicians in Biafra land the elders in Biafra land, the PGs in Biafra land, if you do not retrace your steps now that you have the time, the spirit of our departed heroes and the land of Biafra shall visit not only you, 
but your family and your generation with a terrible vengeance. And again, to the Nigerian government and the Kenyan government, including individuals directly involved in the betrayal and extraordinary rendition of our leader, I give you hereby notice that you shall surely pay a huge, huge price for that crime at our own time and at the place of our own choosing. The price must and will be paid. It does not matter how long it takes, but this crime must be properly, properly situated and I will leave it at that. Let me remind and let me encourage us again to continue our reading of the Psalms because Elohim is a Chuku Kabema and will surely deliver our leader and the Biafran people from the snares of the wicked and the evil ones. Those within and amongst us and those without. Your wicked and evil plans shall come to nothing. The Afrans, I want to borrow from the words of one of our sisters who just wrote that Onyendu Mazin Nam de Kano is our leader. There is no discussion and Biafra is our destination. Remain disciplined in your area of duty, in your area of responsibility, principal officers. If you are not a coordinator, if you are not an administrative officer, do not meddle into affairs of coordination or administration. If you are not a coordinator, do not meddle into the issues of coordination. There are those whose responsibility it is to deal with it. If there are issues, if there are ideas you have, suggestions you wish to make, please follow the proper channel and pass your idea or your suggestions across and it, it will be taken care of. Let me end this very evening broadcast by saying that Biafra is our homeland. Biafra is our identity. And Biafra is our religion. And Chukokike, the all merciful Elohim, to whom alone worship belongs, is whom we worship. I thank you all great Biafrans wherever you are tonight and I encourage you to remain steadfast. I encourage you to remain focused. Above all, I encourage you to remain disciplined for without discipline we cannot win this war which has been brought upon us. But I trust what our leader has put in place. I trust what he has imbibed in us. And I know that we will not disappoint him. Very key. We must not disappoint Onyendo Mazinam, the leader of this great movement. 
Therefore, I commend him and commit him into the hands of merciful Chuko Kabiyama Premihenine, that he may continue to empower him and fill him with his spirit, with understanding, with wisdom, to lead us into a free, independent, and sovereign Biafran nation. May Chukwabiyama guide all of you, and may Chukwabiyama be with all of you. From me, from here, I wish to say good night to you, and thank you for listening. See that what will be, will be This is the time For you and I to stand together as one yeah. There will know, there will know The sun is rising From east to west, from north to south Can't you see the sun is rising? Oh, you wave your flag and be proud of who you are Because the sun is rising Shining so bright all over the world We are the oh. sun, we are rising We spent our lives simply in a misery Never gonna trade our freedom with any mystery It's affecting our soul and it's killing us no slow With what we've been through, we are far from being good But we are blessed by Jugo So we're never gonna give up We're never gonna give up There'll be light in the end of a tunnel to shine so bright all time The whole world will embrace us Nobody can stop 
stop us Nobody can cage us Nobody can send us Yeah There were no There were no The sun is rising From east to west From north to south Can't you see the sun is rising All your way to fly I'm be proud of who you are Because the sun is rising We shining so bright All over the world We are the sun, we are rising The windows and curtains Green lights be every rhythm When I think about how blessed we are Goosebumps all over my body Sunrise to the clock strike Black strands crossing grey stripes Clashes upon clashes Many lives come to ashes When I ponder one and reminisce The actions I see malice Thought on the ground This is how we fly Our beautiful flag All around the world Blood on the ground This is how we fly Our beautiful flag All around the world We go carry the cross together We walk through to Zion We stumble, we we'll rise How do we throw us It's a tribute to a consul, the commander ESN. I have one that I gave you, Sabo Governor, Omo Wasi, Abugisi, on the Maranu, then Abugisi, our life can do one of the Bufusi, Nibulu, Nilemo, Tegawagi, Nibulu, Sabo Guys, if I were again, Nigga, what's up? Makobara Chineke, Gawaya, you come so hammer, be strong like you come so. Biabra, that's up. Sabo ga bossa, biabra that's up. We got one million guns up. Biabra that's up. Full of niba taka bossa. Babylon getting people insane. When I got me a mind fucking burn. Money out sign all about time. Let them know I be on my grind. With them strategic weapon, full of niggas mad. Them I got it so obvious. This time around they can get us. We are coming like a wave of demons. Babylon, Nigeria, and Pupete Control the zoo for fuel and kerosene Don't tell me how to burn When you don't tell me how to run I'm good on garlic and lemon God got me on Zena Respect the man, man I'm not scared to bro Hit back to the dance They come all the way from Hollywood To show me what they want me believe in White Christ, oh shit They got my beast out of its sleep Man, I'm still a Negro How I believe the world's a slavery This and believe you give to evil In Africa, be a man, I'm killing for them I'm a big strong like you come, sir Pull a nibba, tag a boss, sir Chubaha ESL, Chubani the jaw, Chubaga of a dancer ESL no pa ni mo afi when you came on lupo sisi na babsa Onye cholo ga no kuba taja, boko ma fula di finish ya wafa Aya wanda wanda he da finisi, sabo governor boy si ya pugisi Oni maro nu de na pugisi na walanda isi ndi ugu biane medisi Ibu lo nile wante ga wagi, ibu lo sabo boy si fan wegi Hmm, he ga wansa, mako bala chine ke ga wade mi gonsa Hama mi strong like gonsa Yabra, that's up Fula nimba taka bossa Yabra, that's up We got one million in Kunsa Yabra, that's up 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 Yahoo, I'm on my email When you be nigga, you know, like a nigga It's this thing, you know, you get a boogie So, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know You can't so got enough Pull up for area, pull and you gun down All of the sari, you don't they talk Sari, you pull and you don't they talk Say, the vibe is death, not the seed When Defra come, we go chill on Shabbat Eve Nigga, sickness cannot be killed I'm allergic to success, we go win the police I'ma be strong like you can't so Pull and you back, I got boss so 
Chuba ha ESN, chuba ndo jo, chuba jaka wadasa ESN na kwa ni mofya makimwe kima luku sisi na wafya Wenye cholo gana tuzatata, boku mafula kifinisha wafya Aya wanga wana jide tinyishi sabo govano mbwesi ya bugisi Wani maro nude na bugisa wala kiso ndugu ne bukusi Ibu lo nile wate da bagi, ibu lo sabo voice if I win Higa bossa, mako baratine kega wanya ni konsa Hapa kukona ni konsa, ya pradatsa Kula ni bataka bossa, ya pradatsa Wiga wamiya ni konsa, ya pradatsa Ya pradatsa, ya pradatsa Hapa kukona ni konsa, ya pradatsa Kula ni bataka bossa, ya pradatsa Wiga wamiya ni konsa, ya pradatsa Yeah, bro, that's up.